He was an overnight stock boy and I made him quit. Thanks for carrying my treat. Tell, tell Kylie, what are you gonna do to put that together? Tell mom. <laughs> you don't have an answer? Welcome back to Read at Homestead. I am so excited because my factor order just arrived, which is perfect timing because I have such a busy day ahead of me. And I've been so eager to share them with you guys because if you have not heard of factor, I'm about to change your life. One of the things I struggle the most with is that I will be, I'm so busy throughout the day. And usually whatever I'm doing in the moment of like my DIY project that I'm working on, I always prioritize that over stopping and eating and taking care of my body throughout the day. So I usually will skip lunch, I will skip dinner, I will eat a super big meal right before bed and I'll go to bed and then I repeat the cycle every single day and it's just become this really unhealthy cycle that I've got myself into and it's been really hard for me to break. So one of the goals I set for myself this year is I set two alarms on my phone, one for lunch, one for dinner. Those are the two times that I struggle the most with eating and I set those alarms and when that alarm goes off, I take a break and I will stop and eat. And it has changed my life. It's changed my mood. <laughs> I'm so much happier throughout the day. I'm not starving all day. And Factor has made this all possible because with Factor, you don't have to do, you don't have to grocery shop. They're gonna send everything right to your door for you. I don't have to guess about what I'm trying to eat throughout the day. Everything's already in my fridge, ready to go. And the meals come together in just a couple minutes. They are America's number one ready to eat meal kit for a reason because the meals are packed full of flavor and they have so many options on their website. I love that they have breakfast options. They also have smoothies that you can have throughout the day. Mark loves smoothies. So he was very excited to incorporate Factor into his weekly, daily routine. He loves their smoothies, they're delicious. And we have just been so enjoying their service and it is helping me to crush this particular goal and to take care of myself and take care of my body and eat really delicious food. So I will leave my code and a link down in the description below so you guys can check them out. I am so hungry, so I'm actually gonna stop, eat some lunch really quick. I know it's gonna be delicious already, and then we are going to get on with my day. We just got to TJ Maxx. We are looking for a couple chairs, and I'm also looking for a mirror for my mother-in-law's, um, one of her little guest bathrooms. Um, that I haven't, I don't know if I've shown you guys that, or maybe that'll be in this vlog, we'll figure it out. But um, we have a little bit of shopping to do today, which I never am sad about. Always excited, so let's hope that we can actually find what we need. Do you wanna get a cart? Yeah. Well, it we're chair, manifesting. We no, we're manifesting. You always manifest. You get a Gosh, cart. No, if, there's a, if it's a chair, we have to get a flat anyways. I already got sidetracked. Oh gosh, we're like two steps in the street. They have so much stuff happening here. But look at this cute cabinet. I'm just not sure if I love the color of it, but I've been looking for something new for our entryway. And I kind of just think this is really cute. We could keep our shoes in it. Wouldn't that be actually a little bit nice? You're gonna buy that for shoes? No, I just need a new entry table thing. And I think it's oh, I think it's cute and I like the the top. They have this cabinet here, but someone's already put it on reserve. Otherwise, I would literally buy it like right now. It's so pretty. Look at how cute. Ah. Well, do you want me to get someone to put a reserve on it? I don't know. I'm gonna think about it. It's really cute, and it would fit, which is the hardest thing for me to find lately. But let's keep looking. This is so cute, love, love. And then these look like they're really super cute too. I feel like we came on the day of like all the new furniture's out, how lucky. Why is it that if I'm looking for something, can't find it? Like nowhere to be found. But then you find the exact thing we're not looking for. Right, the we exact. We already have bar stools. I know, but look how cute these ones are. They're so cute and I love the color like months ago. I would have like 110% bought these and they swivel. Ah, ah. I'm going to attempt to show you guys this mirror, this black one back here. It's like a Beauty and the Beast. Mirror. What? No, it's a total dupe for the anthropology mirror, but better. <gasps> it's so freaking big. Oh my goodness. Like literally obsessed. How much is it? Let's see. It's so big. I think it's 500 bucks. Yeah, it's 500 bucks. Massive. Beautiful, beautiful. 
Oh my gosh, I kind of want it. Mark was getting tired of being in there because it was so packed. <laughs> there were so many people in there. It looked like they were having like maybe some sort of clearance day or something like yeah, that. Yeah, they're definitely having a clearance sale. You were place. over it. You were over oh, it. <laughs> when the line goes to oh the back God. of the store and then zips around the aisles. Out of control. That's when it's time to go. Out of control. So, but we weren't finding um, what we needed anyway. So it's no big deal. More I things Kylie that I just wanted to bring me down here because there's an Ulta next door. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> you know, like, are you starting to catch on to my tactics? Hey, after I'm like, Jesus, oh, coming on nine years come September. It's just like right there. You might as well just go in. Is oh, that what's geez. happening? That's probably what's happening. You're so funny. Okay, so we are gonna go. I don't know where. Maybe Target. Oh, try Ulta Target. Even looks packed. Look at that line in Ulta. Uh, what are all these people doing? What are they doing? Don't they know we're trying to shop? Like, we should on. go try at home if we're just trying to find chairs. No, I went there the other day. Wasn't that good? Yeah, they didn't have anything. Maybe we should go to like World Market or Target. You know, World Market has some pretty sick chairs. Yeah, they do. World Market's pretty awesome. We could go there to... and we could go to Target. Yeah. Might be fun. Let's try it out. Okay, let's do it. We couldn't find the chair we want. <laughs> They've got some really rock and music going on in the background they here. do we but find the chair we want no but i am caving and i am getting this little dish that is like viral on the internet because it's so freaking cute anything that's marble you guys know i'm here for it and i love it what do you think of that one i was just looking at this one online I think it's really, really cute. I like actually the side details. I think it's really fun. Oh, that's that's nice. And I like this little um, side table as well. That's really cute. What do you think? Hmm. What did you just call this chair? I said the uh, harmless armless chair. Harmless armless? Are you serious? <laughs> it's so funny. That is really cute. I like how wide it is. Is it comfortable? It actually is. It's super cute. If you remember our build competition video, uh, I was building a coffee table. At one point, I talked about multi-levels. Yes. This is what I was trying this to is, execute. This is what you were trying to build? And I definitely did not come out with that if you guys remember. No, you did didn't. not look anything near this boat. guys we're getting the chair I'm so excited we're having them check stock on another location because they don't have um, we need two of them and they don't have two in stock well I could take this one and then another one if I wanted but I don't want the floor model so I'm very excited because we've been looking for a chair for actually how long probably about a year Probably a year. Since you decided to remove the TV out of it. <laughs> Today's the day. It's very exciting. And then I'm going to show you these side tables as well that they have. Is this one here? And it has... Let me see if my... There it goes. I love this marble top so much. Like this whole thing is like me and a side table. So I think I might get two of these too. Oh my gosh. They're so pretty. I love stuff like this. So I really love this coffee table. It's just so simple and the size is so good. And it's only 400 bucks, which I feel like is actually really decent for the size of this. But what was I just saying? Oh, I, you know, she's like, I could probably make that myself. And I'm like, well, you and know. then it'll be solid wood. And I said, well, do you want you know, that's pretty heavy when you build it straight out of solid wood. You mean you don't, you this don't? This one's feather light. It's yeah. like maybe 25 pounds. Because it's not real wood. Yeah. But is, you know, you're saying that you don't want another 300 pound coffee table like our one right now? Well, I mean, I guess that's why you married me, just, just to move heavy stuff. So I guess it's fine. <laughs> but, um. But you'd prefer I'd that prefer I don't do that to light. <laughs> Whatever. I was going to say something. But then your hat started to shift. Oh, yeah. <laughs> also, I'm getting this tree. This is why we never come to the world market because we always end up buying everything. So I found snacks. There's this stuff. Wow. Have look you ever at had you. Tim Tams? No, I haven't. Oh, they're so good. You can suck milk through them. So you like bite each end and then it's like a chocolate straw. It's You're so funny. And then they don't what really else? have too much Cadbury stuff. So I got some of this. I okay. Don't know. Wow. And then I'm probably going to buy a couple more snacks. Amazing. I'm glad that you're finding, you're keeping yourself busy. 
while you're shopping for yeah, furniture. Yeah, this is great. Yeah. Good plan. Thanks for carrying my treat. <laughs> you like that one? Those. Well, I like anything <laughs> that has dimension. Yeah. I like this one a lot. I think this is so pretty. Vintage inspired and it's so big. I love it. I'm so excited because we got one chair and I got a plant and then we're gonna run to a different store, pick up the other chair and the side tables because they didn't have two of the side tables in stock. So it's a good day. I'm trying to convince Mark that we need to go back to Home Goods before they close to see if that one cabinet is been picked up yet because it was on hold and from what I know they're only allowed to keep something on hold until the end of the day so you know they could have left to go pick up their truck or something but maybe they decide they don't want it and then it's still there and then I have to buy it well, and what we saw is the sticker on it said Matt which I have a brother named Matt I know. so we could go maybe and either I him. act as Matt or we could have Matt come with you us. could pretend to be Matt no, this is a good plan. We're not bad people. We're not just gonna say we're not what we are. Oh, sorry. This is like shining the, on your I'm face. I'm an angel. <laughs> You're an angel. I'm an angel. You are an angel. Oh but I'm trying gosh. to convince Mark that we need to go back before close to see if it's still there. And if it is, then it's just meant to be mine because I really want it. We're accidentally refurnishing our entire apartment today. I mean, apartment. I'm thinking about our. <laughs> I keep thinking about our apartment because. We're, well, we haven't been to World Market in 500 years, and the, I don't know why we don't go there that much. Probably because I stopped shopping there, or because I stopped working there, because we had an employee discount. It was like 50% off. Yeah, that was amazing when you worked there. Mark used to work there for a very, very short period of time when we first got married, and I made him quit because he was an overnight stock boy, and I was really tired of him not being... Like, I didn't, I didn't like sleeping alone. I didn't like being alone like newlywed we were like newlywed <laughs> yeah like literally newlyweds and he was it was just a little part-time side job for some extra money and i was like you need to quit this because i hate being without you at night it sucked so so we quit <laughs> okay our third world market of the day you guys they didn't have the chair but they got I got the two side tables so that's good the marble side tables I think I'm showing you guys I've been filming for Instagram and for this so I'm really confused by this <laughs> but don't um, know what I don't know about. what I've been talking about but we're gonna hopefully get the chair now Gracie what are you doing <laughs> she does not want us to move around the living room she saw boxes She's so like, she's oh like, no. Please don't move anything. She's like, please don't do it. Please don't move around. Oh man, my settings are all messed up from being in my freaking purse. Okay, no, I'm, I'm making it worse. Oh. Ah, I don't know. Okay. Are you excited? Woo! He's very excited. I'm, I was actually like, we can wait until tomorrow. And he's like, no! no. We're putting everything together tonight. I'm not I'm doing so garbage excited. tomorrow. Hi. Hi. Toast, come up here. Come say hi to Kim. Come here. <laughs> And then I don't see trouble. Okay, over here. we're going to put the living room together. This is how our living room currently looks. I have these random um, nightstands that I bought. To, these are for a flip. Yeah, these are flip. Not I just for design. I, yeah, I just put them in here to get them out of the garage temporarily. So now I'm going to put them back in the garage since now we have new side tables, which I'm very excited about. So Ooh. I think I'm hoping the chairs will fit. They will fit. You think they're gonna fit? Well, if they don't fit, we'll make them fit. We're gonna make You know them. how to weld, right? It's gonna look They good. just have a metal frame. We can weld them. Oh my gosh. Gracie, you're just being so pretty right now. You're just being so pretty for the camera, huh? She's like, look, I sit so good. I sit so good. Here's our super heavy coffee table that Mark was talking about. <laughs> You guys, I built this. I get a lot of questions on where is this coffee table from. I built it. This was one of my very first solo DIY builds. I can't remember if I built this before or after our kitchen. I think it was after our kitchen remodel. Did I build this before or after? I think it was after. But you it was got like the my first and you're like, like, you know what? I really want to try and build something on my own. Yeah. And I did it. Found, yeah, you did it. You found the prints for it and you're like, yeah. okay, I can do that myself. It was so You made it a little bit bigger because we needed a bigger one here and it right. was still too small. 
But here we are, like, <laughs> two years later. It's been great. Yeah. Are we going to build another one? I don't know. <laughs> I think we will. You're seeing my half-painted baseboard right now? So Are they? Cool. Is it on camera? Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> the yes. number one tick to, uh, trick to any project is don't move the furniture, paint around it, and then you only have to do half as much I work. I don't think that's. I don't think that's right. Did we at least paint the wall? Hey, you know what? We at least painted the oh, wall. The wall painted. The no, wall's painted. I didn't paint the baseboard because <laughs> our old couch that we had was literally Giant. so heavy like there was just i was like no i'm i'm the next time i'm gonna move this couch is when we redo the floors so that's that i'm gonna have to paint that it's gonna drive me crazy <laughs> are you just like what's going on what is going on right now why is everything moving does it make you nervous yeah it's okay it's okay. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna love her. She's so pissed off right now. <laughs> She's so She's like, sassy. Why are you moving everything? I guess Gracie wants to volunteer for tonight. She does. She's part of the Last helping crew. I checked, you don't have thumbs to put things together. You have mitts. You have little paws. So how are you gonna put stuff together? Tell, tell Kylie, what are you going to do to put that together? Tell Mama. You don't have an answer? You don't just get to sit there and look pretty. You got to work. If you're going to be out here, you got to work. That this unzips here at the bottom, so you could definitely take it apart and clean it if you ever needed to. And These so come do off, the arms. The back comes off, and so does the arms. This part doesn't come off, but you could easily just um, shampoo it. Yeah, use a carpet cleaner on it and just shampoo it if you needed to. So that's that's really simple. But these are what I would expect to get like the most kind of wear and tear or like dirty over time. So I'm glad that those come off and you can just. Sign has got to go. It's Sign. needed to go for a long time. Even you agree. Oh my gosh. It needs to go. I think we should make a table out of it. No, we should not. It needs to go. Who else was married in 2014 that needs a sign? ASAP. <laughs> That's like literally so much better already. It's not even funny. It's the next day and I wanted to show you how beautiful the living room looks. I'm calling this like my mini living room makeover <laughs> because it was so just kind of like impromptu in the moment. And now we have a nice little refresh on the living room. It's nowhere near done by any means. Like this whole space needs a lot of work, but Compared to where I was like a few months ago, this space has already seen a lot of change and just slowly but surely, like this has just been a very slow transformation because this is one of the hardest rooms to decorate. But I'm happy with the progress so far. So let me show you guys how it turned out. So our living room is the first thing that you see when you walk into our home. So it's definitely the most important view. And this room is just so awkward. <laughs> it's just like, long and not super wide and there's no good spot for a TV. It's just kind of an awkward layout, but I feel like we're making progress slowly but surely over the years. These chairs made such a big difference in here and I love the side detail of them because it's just something interesting to look at and they also look nice from the back. So having them pulled out against a wall, like away from a wall like this, looks really beautiful and now it just feels like a conversation area and i love that i also love that we were able to place these in such a way that if someone sits here or here they have a spot to put a drink if someone sits over here they have a spot to put a drink 
And if someone sits over in this chair, they have a spot to put a drink. So this room needs a lot of work still. So one of these days we will do like a full living room makeover. A couple of the things that I'm gonna be shopping for in the meantime and looking for will be a new coffee table. Um, either I'll find one or maybe I'll just end up making one. We'll see. I also wanna find a new TV console. We've had this one for like a super long time and have it's been through like every type of possible um, <laughs> placement in this room. I'm <laughs> trying to figure out where the heck it could go. Ultimately, it's just too big. It doesn't fit the space. And now I have it over this area, which is like totally interior design, super incorrect. <laughs> like you should not have curtains behind the TV. Like it's just weird. It needs to be a lot smaller, something that maybe will only fit the TV and fit this space nicer. I also, um, I put this tree here temporarily. I'm gonna move it to the dining room, but I want to find a lamp to go in this corner. I think that would look really nice. I didn't wanna put any lamps on the side tables because the cord just made the whole thing look super cluttery. So I'm gonna shop for a lamp to go there. And then I'm also going to shop for a lamp to go over in this corner. That way this is like a little reading the little deck. I think that will be really cute and then I won't have a lamp there. Um, this room is so dim. Like one thing that we really need to do is have some can lights installed because it's just like the worst lighting. I eventually wanna do a wall treatment on this, maybe some board and batten or maybe some shiplap or something, something to just take up this whole entire wall. Cause what the heck do you do with a wall this size? Like, I, I think a climbing wall, honestly. Oh my gosh, like a rock wall? It's tall That's enough it's so, and it's wide enough. It's so weird. It's just like the weirdest thing, but. Anyway, I love the way that this room has come together. We're making progress, which is all that matters. And I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. This was so much fun. Little like mini impromptu living room makeover. But thank you for hanging out, guys. We will see you in the next video. Bye.